Hi, welcome to another video from the best of cat series. In this question, we are going to look at how numbers are constructed and represented in the form of variables. So do try this question out on your own, pause the video and then have a look at the solution that will follow. If you like our content and want to experience the IMS pedagogy, you can join the IMS zero fee prep programs that will give you access to concept videos, sectionals, full length tests and more for free. You may click on the i button or on the link in the description box below to access the same. Happy learning. Now this question is fairly straightforward. It's an extremely easy question if you look at it and if you know how to construct these numbers. So whenever someone tells you that there is a two digit number, you have to represent it in the form of 10x plus y. You cannot write it simply as xy purely because xy has multiple notations. Now xy on the face of it seems to be a two digit number. But xy can also mean multiplication of x and y. Whereas if you write the number as 10x plus y, it will tell you that x and y are two single digit numbers. The x that we have here is at the tens place. And so the face value x will be multiplied by the place value 10 to give you 10x as the value of that particular place. And then y being at the units place, the value of that number is going to be y itself. So if you have to construct the number, you will construct it as 10x plus 5. Now let's have a look at what is being expected from us in the question. How many two digit numbers with a non-zero digit in the units place? This basically means that if this is a two digit number, y is not equal to zero. Are there which are more than thrice the number found by interchanging the positions of the digits? So the original number that we have here, 10x plus y should be more than or should be greater than what? thrice the number formed by interchanging the digits should be greater than thrice the number that has been formed by interchanging the digits. So another advantage of writing it as 10x plus y is that the number that is formed by interchanging the digits or reversing the digits in this case is going to be 10y plus x. Now if you just simplify this bit, you should be able to get the answer. So you are going to get 10x plus y is greater than 30y plus 3x. Now you can bring 3x to the left hand side and can remove it from 10x. So we will get 7x is greater than 30y minus y that is going to be 29y. This is what we are going to get in this particular case. Now after that it is a matter of substituting different values of either x or y and trying to figure out as to what all cases are possible. Now obviously 7x being the smaller uh, value to calculate, right? it is not the smaller number but it is uh, an easier value to calculate. So we will start by putting values for x. Now if you put x equal to 1, what is going to happen? 7 is not going to be greater than 29y unless y becomes 0. But y is not expected to be 0. So y cannot be 0. If you put x equal to 2, 3 or 4, you are again going to get a similar case. So the smallest value for x that gives you a chance of making it greater than 29y, where y is greater than 0 is going to be when x equals 5. So when x equal to 5, y can take only one value. right? When x is equal to 5, y can take only one value that is 1 itself. Because if y becomes 2, 29 2s are 58 which violates the inequality. What happens if x equals 6? When x equals 6, we will have 42 greater than 29y. Which will mean that y can again take only one value that is 1 itself. What happens when x is equal to 7? 7 7s are 49, 29 1s are 29. If you go to 29 into 2, you are going to get a number that is greater than 49. So we will again have only one solution for this wherein y is equal to 1. What happens if x is equal to 8? 7 8s are 56, 56 is still less than 58, which means that y can take only one possible value which is 1. What happens when x is equal to 9? When x is equal to 9, you are going to get 7 9s are 63 greater than 29y. Now in this case, if y is equal to 1, of course 29 is going to be less than 63. But even if y is equal to 2, 58 is going to be less than 63. And so in this particular case, we are going to get two values for y that are possible, which is y equal to 1 and y equals 2. So we have a total of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6 solutions when it comes to this particular condition. And so our answer is going to be option 1. Now if you have understood the question and you want to try another on your own, we have a replica question at the end of this video. 
Do try that out and post your answers in the comment section below. Happy learning.